So today I want to talk about our angle guide. This is a great product for marking your pavers. When you are laying an infield of large format pavers, or any kind of pavers for that matter, and you're butting up against a vertical edge like we are here. I've kind of mocked this up so you can hopefully get the idea. But I want to go through step by step how this tool works and how fast and efficient it is. I obviously have a spot right here that I've kind of laid it out that I want to fill that piece. So I want to fill it with a slab such as this. And again, normally I'd have to take a tape measure and try to get that product measured and marked. I could mark the one side, maybe mark the middle, maybe mark the end. So then I got to transfer over onto my paper those measurements and then line it up. Angle guide is really cool and I'm going to show you just quickly um, just a couple of the steps that's required. It has a locking mechanism here that's going to slide this in and out. This angle guide, that's where it gets the name, the angle guide is going to adjust the angle in which I want to cut my paver up against my fixed edge. It has a little 90 degree angle here. This is going to mark the edge of my paver, the back side of my paver, and that would be this spot right here. So I'll just kind of go through it. I'm going to make my first measurement. I'm going to take my, my angle guide, it would be your right side of it here, and I'm going to place it against my last laid paver. And again, I want this all the way to my right side. Holding the tool, I'm going to stretch this out. It's going to do one of two things. This is going to get my length, but it's also going to get my angle. At that point, I'm going to mark this or I'm going to tighten this. That's going to lock this into place. So again, this distance from here to there, that's the exact piece that I'm going to need to fill this. I bumped it with my arm. I'm just going to get this in. Now what I'm going to do, if I'm going to put this paver in this hole, I hold this now. Again, this is this corner right here. Hopefully that makes sense. I'm going to hold this right on the very corner. So that I can mark this here. So you can see this angle is the exact angle of this right here. Now I want to mark this angle, because obviously this isn't just one straight cut, it's another angle. And if it's a radius, you can do the same thing. You could do it in a few different places. I've marked right here this point and again with being a random pattern it just depends on where that paper is going to end so I've already marked where that ends now I'm going to take again loosen this up the left side again this mark simulates this corner of the paper now I'm going to stretch this again and you can see this is kind of tight right here and it automatically will stay once I push it out. I hold it to this angle. Again, I'm going to lock it. Now what I can do, I hold this to this point. Using my marker, I mark my other side. This is those two angles. So now I'll cut this paver, and then we're going to drop it into place. So now I've cut my piece. And you can see these are those two angles. And when I drop this in, it should be a perfect fit. It's exact, and that's really what makes this tool shine. You get really crisp, clean marking, so when you cut, you get a perfect fit every time. So another unique feature with the angle guide is it's got this little tab 
This is kind of to hold you square and at a 90 and button up against the proper product. And it's reversible. So I could pull this unit out, slide it back in. I think I'm, I'm gonna show you this section here. This would obviously help me with my corner. That's gonna help me with that corner. I just slide it right in tight and butt it, and that's it. I slide this out, get my angle, I tighten it down, and now when I go to mark this piece, I'm just pushing it over tight. It gives me exact mark of reference. I mark that piece, and that would fit right in there. So again, I've made a nice crisp cut here. That's my angle guide. Drops right in. Perfect marking everything.